new kings and kingdoms hello students around 17th century there were big and rich landlords in various regions of the continent who were being referred as samantas by the kings the duty of samantas was to bring gifts for the kings and help the kings by providing military support because of power and wealth samanta sometimes called themselves as maha samanta maha mandaleshwara let's see an example when samantas asserted their independence from kings rashtrakutas were the subordinates of chalukyas of karnataka but in mid 18th century a rashtrakuta chief named danti durga threw a chalukya king and did a ritual hiranya garbha which led to rebirth of kshatriya let us see the chalukya dynasty it was a powerful indian royal dynasty that ruled large parts of southern and central india between the 6th and the 12th century ce during this period they ruled as three related but individual dynasties the earliest dynasty known as the badami chalukyas ruled from their capital vatapi from the middle of the 6th century later on the badami chalukyas began to assert their independence at the decline of the kadamba kingdom of banavasi and rapidly rose to prominence during the reign of pulakesi 2 609 to 642 CE